Hello, I'm back. Here, this video, I'll show you each and every motor I have at this point. Here is a, a small motor from a vacuum cleaner, the add on. Stupid, uh. Alright. And here is a, a good motor. There it is. Just I'll flip it over. There it is. And, uh, I'll show you how to how I wired this one. So the L1. L1 is a. Uh, oops, there we go. Sorry about that. L1 is a uh, is white and yellow, as you can see, and the uh, the brown wire right there is to the power cord. That's L1. L2 is a uh, is a yellow wire with black markings, and that is a. Uh, a blue, which another one, and the green yellow one is well ground, obviously. There it is. So there is the wire. There is how I wired it. I, I think I forgot to mention as capacitor start. I have another one right there. I have a Dayton motor. I have my old uh, ceiling fan. I forgot where I got that one from. And my my spa motor, which is right there. That is a uh, to a spa slash pool trash picked out. All right, so uh, right there's from an old box fan trash picked as well. Now I'll show you each and every one when I just put this on my tripod like so. The first one I'll show you is my day Dayton motor running. So it's just uh, plug it in. Flip the power. This is a very quiet motor, as you can tell. So that's motor one I have. Just since I have long caps, oh sure. My next one is a small high high speed motor. So let's put that cap on, put that on, plug it in, it does have high torque, it's small but powerful. Right. And if you look closely right there, right there, you see a spark. And that is my small high speed motor right there. So now I should do that one. The next one I'll show you is is the uh, the box fan. Oops. Hopefully it won't fall down. There we go. Fixed it. Now this one I'm showing you is a box fan motor. Here it is. I added a little connect piece on top to or to the motor so then I can. Make stuff, make stuff spin. Fun connects. Here we go. That sound that you're hearing is the tape right there that's holding the rotor and the connects piece together. That the motor itself is completely silent. If I took the tape off, it would you wouldn't really know if it's running or not because it is like literally that quiet. Now then, the next motor I'll be showing you is the good motor. I think I uh, I showed you how to wire it. So let's plug it in, have it run. There we go. Does have a fast wind down, so that is good motor number one. The second motor I have laying over here. This is kind of heavy, weighs about 10, maybe 20 pounds. I'm not exactly sure. Now let's have this one run.
This does throw a lot of air around. Yeah. Ready? So that's good motor number two. And the another motor I'll be showing you running. Well, what's the point point this? I'm gonna pick it up anyway. Uh, move that, make that, put that on, boy. And this is the the ceiling fan. I have it. I still have it attached to my homemade arid siren. I have this little eye hook so I can pick it up and move it around freely. Place it right there. There you go. Plug it in, have it run. I will not be running that one today because I don't want to uh, take off the impeller which I have right there. I added fan blades to the to the chopper. No, it's 12 ports right there. I think I forgot to mention about my refrigerator fan right there. There's a small small motor right there, and that is on. That is my homemade laptop cooler. It's very efficient. It's a uh, has a motherboard and everything to make a computer run is on top as well. There is my homemade Thunderbolt as well, and there is the the other part that came with the uh, that came with the uh, the pool motor when I trash picked that. Uh, Alright, so thanks for watching. And Hello, uh, I forgot to mention about my refrigerator motor. There you go, Let's just plug it in, turn it on. Ow. There you go, ready? There you have it. Set it down. Turn it on. So uh, that's pretty much the last motor I can show you right now. It's my uh, air raid sign. I finished it. That's gonna be another video though. Uh, see you later. Oh, I forgot to mention and yet another motor. This is from a, uh, a dehumidifier. <coughs> Here is the, uh, the fan with blade, the fan motor. And I wired it up like so. Let's just uh, plug it in. This is a very quiet motor. It's, it may sound like that it's not running at all, but it actually is.
And so there you have it. Yet another motor I have. So thanks for watching and uh, see you next time.